Praise the Lord. Hallelujah. Hallelujah. My dear brothers and sisters, when we pray in our families, there should be unity in our families. When you pray with unity, there will be the power and the presence of the Holy Spirit powerfully manifested in that family. The answers will be immediate and everyone will experience that blessing. We read like this, Acts of the Apostles, chapter 1, verse 14. We read like this. When the disciples were gathered together in preparation for the Pentecost, how did they gather together and pray? It is very clearly mentioned in the Bible. All these were constantly devoting themselves to prayer together with certain women, including Mary, the mother of Jesus, as well as his brothers. All these were constantly devoting themselves to prayer, constantly united together in prayer. And then there was blessing of the Holy Spirit upon them. They all were filled with the power of the Holy Spirit. Praise the Lord. Praise the Lord. Thank you, Jesus. Thank you, Jesus. They were united together with one mind and one heart. We read like this, verse 13 onwards, let's read. When they had entered the city, they went to the room upstairs where they were staying. Peter and John and James and Andrew, Philip and Thomas, Bartholomew, Matthew, James, son of Salphius, and Simon the Zealot, and Judas, son of James. Continue. All these were constantly devoting themselves to prayer together with certain women, including Mary, the mother of Jesus, as well as his brothers. Verse 15. In those days, Peter stood up among the believers, and together the crowd numbered among 120 persons. So, 120 persons together as one mind, one heart, one spirit, they pray together and the power of the Holy Spirit descended upon them. There was no disunity, complications and conflict in them and therefore their prayers were answered in a special way by the infilling of the Holy Spirit. Praise the Lord. Praise the Lord. Now let's all pray together in a special way so that let there be unity and peace in our families. Let there be unity, sincere unity. Let all disunity and complications and conflict be destroyed in the holy name of Jesus. Let us pray for this intention.